already, as you guys know by now, this is a gator hunt. Of course, the night before the hunt at 1.48 a.m. Can't sleep, gotta be up in uh, four, four hours. Maybe earlier, I don't really know. Um, so yeah, see you guys then. How you dress for a gator hunt? I don't know. Oh. Get some dunk. Turn left. So we just met up with the guide at the ranch right now. Not at the ranch, but at his house. So loading up back there, um, and we're gonna head out to the ranch. It'll be about an hour drive, and I'll explain how. So we just got out of here on the ranch. Um, tell us a little bit about the plan, what we're gonna do. Well, um, you know, it, the water is so low, we've never seen it this low before. We, we, we're we having a pretty bad drought here in South Florida. Uh, fires and everything else. Yeah. So whatever water there is left, there all the gators in the neighborhood are in there. So we're gonna grab these rods and we're gonna throw them in there, see if we can snag one out, fight them on the rod for a while. And then we'll see if it's something we want to keep. Sounds good. If it is, then we can use that spear. We can use a, a gun, whatever you want right. to do to dispatch them with. Awesome. And um, and that's pretty much it. There is not much to it this time because the water's so low, so we're right. limited in the spaces. But right. that's the good news is <laughs> we know where they all are. Right. Yeah. <laughs> so no, you know, wish I'm, I had a better camera. I could get in on the pictures, but there's about million gators in here so uh, well when they see us they go down yeah of course, so. they were right there but now, right. now they're underwater except so, for the little ones the yeah. little ones aren't that spooky so we'll hook a couple get them in see if we want it so yeah sounds good let's right. have some fun let's get out of here down by the tail. Hey guys, I'm uh, editing this video and I realized that things got a little bit hectic in the heat in the moment and not a lot of stuff got explained here. So on my first cast, I uh, throw in, I hook this big gator, um, fight him for about 20, 30 minutes. Um, eventually here we decide that this is the gator we want to kill. Um, he's a big gator, he's about nine, nine feet, two inches or something like that is what we eventually taped him out at. 
Um, so in a minute here, you wait, and uh, you'll see we had to wait a second for you someone tired? to grab the spear because we forgot it back at the ATVs. <laughs> um, that's when you get that cool shot of the gator in the water. Well, a little um, more than those So, yeah, and then we don't really talk about the gator after we get it. We just move on to my dad's because um, we you don't have a lot of time on this hunt. Talk to us. So I hope you guys like the rest of the video, and, um, yep. See you. Spear him. Again. That should be good. I think I have a Yeah, I'm thinking about should I make shoes or a belt? Yeah, I don't know. Just help me grab this tail and try to pull them out a little bit. First for the ladies and then they'll let you go. Yeah guys, so this was a great hunt. Got this big gator. Uh, I see a few pictures of him. Didn't really get a video of us talking about him, but it's a great hunt, big gator, and uh, let's get on to my dad's. going on? It's got hooked into one. That's a nice gator. How big is he? We're not going to pull him in because he's got that damn line in his mouth. Hey, I'm telling you, they can pull. That's really nice. He oh. had that thing in his mouth. Yeah. Hey, hand that off her. Hand that off to your son. Okay, Chase, tell you. Okay, give me the camera. Is it on? It is. Don't lose him. Oh. Let's, uh, just reel down yeah. and come underneath me. That's, That's the death roll. <laughs> That's a nice one. That's what they're for. Though. I thought there's a gator design issues. Right there? Yeah. Ha! Yeah, so this was an awesome hunt. My dad just got his, as you saw. Um, first cast, first gator he hooked is the one we wanted to kill. Measured within about a half an inch of mine, and it was a great hunt. That was awesome. Got in here, hooked Pretty him. Pretty strong, yeah, huh? Really strong. Got All a good right. bite to him. That you and fun. your dad both got about the same gator within what, half an inch? Yeah, half an inch or so. So. Wow, what are the chances you get <laughs> the same gator? That's how you want to do it. But yeah, awesome. man, they're, they're pretty strong for yeah. somebody who's never done this before. Uh, these fighters. gators are very tough animals, very strong animals. Sure. A lot of fun doing this. You catch them with the rod, you get to feel that strength, you get to fight them a little bit. So. You know, it's a little bit better, you know, a little bit more fun than just shooting one. But either way, uh, it's, a, it's a great hunt. Yeah, you know, sure. good meat. A lot of good meat. That's what and we're doing for. Get and, the meat. And you need one for your trophy room or man cave, of course. Yep. So, so thank you, sir. Hey, man. Great hunt. Good shooting, boy. All right, guys. So we just finished up the gator hunt on our way back to the hotel. Um, hang out for a little bit before you see part two of this video. It might be a two-part video maybe one we'll see how much footage i got out of the gator hunt um and just a couple notes about the gator hunt so you're gonna see us throw cast obviously the gators it was it was a lot easier this time because florida's having a pretty severe drought down in the south part of florida um there was just a fire as we were coming in closed down the highway um from miami but so all the gators were basically stocked up in these only ponds where normally it'd be a lot harder to hunt them it's pretty easy, so it's good to get the food. Good to bring some gator meat back to Colorado. Um, so these gators, um, they grow about a foot a year until they're six feet tall, six feet long, and then they slow down a bunch. So the gators we killed were nine, nine, two, nine, three. Here, Dad, about nine. Um, so yeah, and then um, so they were about thirty years old, is what he said, 25, 30 years old. So pretty cool to get an old big gator like that 
Yeah, so with the spear, instead of, we decided to hunt them with the spear and um, kill them that way just to make it a little bit more, you're in, with them, you're in it, um, a little bit more to the tradition of it. Um, yeah, so instead of just shooting with a gun, could have made it even a lot easier, but we decided to do it that way. Um, so, cut the... Thanks for watching the Chase Watson Outdoor Life. Please subscribe, like, and comment. You.